Happy New Year and welcome to the last part of our holiday Vlogmas special! Let's get started! Today, I'm going to show you how to make mochi with a mochi making machine! ta -da! Look at this! This is so old! This is such a classic mochi making machine. Mm. I got it from my aunt and then she, didn't, she doesn't do any more, so she gave it to me. So we are making mochi for New Year, January 1st. Oh. Traditionally in Japan, we offer this rice cake, white rice cake, to the god, mm. Kamisama. Mm -hmm. mm. And then the reason why we start eating mochi for New Year is mochi is very sticky, right? So it's very, very difficult to break. Mm. So that means uh, you can get longer life, like mochi. Ah. Nice and long life. So how do you use this thing? It's very interesting. So, open this first. Mm. Oh wow, interesting. And inside, we are gonna put water here. Ah. <laughs> in here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cook rice in here. And then it pounds in here. Like without this, they have to do... Oh, that's right, that's right. But it does that, all of that in here. Yes. Oh, wow. So this is the one kilogram of mochi rice. And we're gonna put it in here. Okay. Smells good already. Put the lid on! Musu! Steam! Let's go! So it's gonna take 20 minutes to finish steaming. And meanwhile, let's start the vlog. ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ。ふふふ
and you can see, oh, it already shot up there. All right, ginger tea. This is really good in the winter time because it heats you up. So add this in there. And this battery powered mug is going to keep the tea nice and hot while we're out here, freezing cold. Open. Ooh. Ooh. It's curry rice, guys! It smells really good. Mmm! Mmm! <laughs> Whoa! That is a cup of flavor. That's super good! That's better than a lot of curries that I've eaten even in restaurants mm, in Japan. We should sponsor this company. Chinese. Yeah, it's really good. Ooh! 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 Spicy oil. Nice. Mm. Ooh, that looks good, actually. Itadakimasuru! Mmm! It's like a Chinese hot pot flavor. Ah, Chinese hot pot flavor. Chinese instant rice soup. Mmm. It tastes really authentic. So, mm. it tastes like instant food. Our favorite tofu dessert. Cheesecake flavored tofu. Yes. And these are not raisins, these are kuromame. Eh? Ooh. Is it tofu or cake? Looks tofu. Looks like tofu, ne? <laughs> it's really good. A little bit of tofu flavor, mm. but it's not so sweet. Almost like a cheesecake without the cake. Mm. But the texture is it's like a soft tofu. Mm. Soft mm. Mm. It has the richness of cheesecake, but without the heaviness. Yeah, you can still taste the tofu in there. So, There's like something extra in there. So it's light. Yeah. Very light. Mm. There's something that your dad says, anything you eat outside is delicious. Yes. I, in this case, I really agree with him. I don't feel cold anymore. I'm nice no, and, nice and heated up. Yeah. And I'm still holding the heating mug. <laughs> is it still this hot? Is, yeah. This oh, is yeah. amazing. You smell that? It, it smells like somebody is cooking like the, an old closet. <laughs> you just take all the old clothes in a closet and start cooking it. Like, is it safe to eat? I don't know. It smells old. It smells like hot old. <laughs> oh! Oh, it's starting! Whoa! 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 Yes, yes, You can't stop Mochi no. Monster! <laughs> Give it a little taste test. Mmm. <laughs> you can tell it's very fresh. The freshest mochi mm. you ever eaten, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, it? It's chewy. It's silky. It's smooth. Nineteen eighties technology. Yeah. Mmm. Make it Let's go some. Oh my gosh. So 2021 was a very, very amazing time for us. Can't thank you guys enough. Yeah, cannot thank you guys enough. This is like a miracle, a miracle to us that Arigato Internet and Arigato everybody. <laughs> Never really thought I'm the one who become the face of the channel. <laughs> yeah, it, it was something that you wanted to do. You you saw me doing YouTube so, on so, my so, channel. So, so. Yes, yes, yes. And yes. you were kind of looking to start your own channel. It looked fun mm -hmm. while Mr. Eats was making his cooking channel. I don't know where to start. And I didn't know what's my strength. Towards the end of 2019, there were right. a lot of Japanese people making reaction mm -hmm. videos. And I thought, hey, you could do that. I was just purely having fun watching the video and giving my thoughts. And after that, we decided to go deeper. Pancho!
Kanjo is something I personally been doing for the rest of my life, and my mom hates it. And as a Japanese, you know, you you got to learn how to kanjo, right? And then I was doing kanjo to Mr. Eats, like a lot. Then when I saw Filthy Frank's kanjo video, I was like, this is it. We didn't want to make a regular reaction video like we we had made. We want it to be something more special, mm. something that we put more effort mm, mm, in it. Mm, yeah, and that was that was that was your idea to no, no, no. to really make that reaction video much <laughs> bigger than it was. So, and I was like, okay, let's do it. Let's figure it out. So, yeah. you know, we spent like an afternoon working on it, and then we shot it, and it turned out to be really fun. So there are a couple of things that we sort of collected along the way on our first live stream. You remember this? Yeah, of course. We went to the ramen museum in Osaka. Yeah, we made this custom ramen and on it it says thank you for 30,000. This was February 20th. And then I remember going into the chat room and telling everybody, please hold on uh, because we're, we're having some technical issues. And there were like 60 people waiting. I was like freaking out. I was like, oh, oh 60 people. Oh my god. That's right. That's right. <laughs> we were expecting like maybe eight people. Yeah, I don't think I'll ever eat this. To be honest, mm. this I don't know. For, for me, this feels really special. Mm. At 40,000 subscribers, I believe we picked this one up in Nara. Nara. We did our very first Nara live stream, and this one is the Deer Poop Chocolate. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Expired <laughs> in like June 30th. <laughs> oh, it just looks like regular chocolate. Cheers. Hmm. Mm. It's like an M&M. Mm. This one, I believe we got it at 70,000 subscribers mm. in Kyoto Arashiyama mm. on our live stream. Yes. And this one is definitely expired, yeah. I'm sure. May 10th. May 10th. <laughs> this one is a little green tea cookie sandwich. Hey, it still looks good. The cookie is not as crisp mm. as, it, as it should be, but it's not bad. Mm. The flavor's still really good. It's a nice light green tea flavor. This is all because of you guys. And we hope that you guys are looking forward to all of the great content that we're gonna be making for you guys yes. in 2022. Just like full body entertainment. <laughs> we just wanna take a look back yes. at some of our favorite moments yes. of 2021 <laughs> and with all of you guys. So let's enjoy it together. Let's go. I'm not touching women, I'm not hentai. Oh, did you go out for a run or something? No, I just took a dump. Go. Oh, go. Oh, oh shit! But, but, turkey for dinner! Hancho is a Japanese game, but you're wrong. Wow. So wow. First, go to the elevator in the back. Take it up to the ground floor, then look for the DARPA chief. I have to get honey bun while I'm here. This is my first mission to complete. We are Corona Busters! Debug me, sete yo! Debug! Yes! Because he didn't want to hurt his friend or lover. Oh no, there's a poster here for a show called Hentai Prison. Can't you the like button? Can't you the like button? <laughs> So 2021 was such a such a journey for us and then hopefully you enjoyed our journey in 2021 and I will see you guys in 2022. Okini! Okay,